¡Chan! A ver, ponme la pila. Hey, welcome here, and I have an Apple Touch for duration, and I decide and was messy around my Apple Touch, and I'm on firmware 5.1.1, and it's set to update for today, and reboot it, and we're going here, and we're going to see here, and we're going to see what happens. Here's what happens. If I go to settings, for a tap on settings. General, when I tap on new stage, you can see this. This one will do a little customizing on the touch. I have no idea, but I knew when Apple the battery switch on on touch, and I can see there's no battery switch for seconds on the touch, so I can't turn on the battery set. And you can please tell me how to turn this on without having any jailbreak because I don't want to jailbreak my iPod Touch because it's definitely going to screw up the whole entire software. I can manage apps or do iCloud things, but that's all the stuff I can do in the touch. And when I get to you. And I don't know any what is, does anyone know? So why would Apple do a customizing the touch? Is how my Apple made the touch when the touch was designed with the default set of batteries. And after the time of I was quite point one, then the fight was point one. This setting was what was, was this was customized the touch. The Apple was the, uh, customizing the touch. Uh, was an iCloud settings, but you have no longer have the. Bad disruption in the touch. But that kind of sucks. Anyway, why would uh, Apple do that to the touch? I don't know. What Apple like does make them like, I don't know idea. If you please tell me how to get this get this back to normal. I'm a remember, I'm a virgin fight point one point one firmware and you can see and you can see it no is your system iPod. I can see it's 11, I just 11 27 p.m. in the in the afternoon, is at night time, and we have to buy the key. What I have to do is I turn on voiceover, which I used to navigate around to 69% battery. Well, I installed the battery watch program. You see, it tells your battery, the Naito. I installed the battery watch program. It's free in the app store and tells your battery where your batteries are. And I'm on 65% of battery. But I noticed this that there will be an ad on your. There will be an ad. Just a review, but. There will be an ad on it on the download. Uh, I'm. Uh, uh, I'm doing this. I'm. I can see them. They have, I have installed the battery watch program that definitely tells you what the battery is. But the free version has the apps that you did pay for them. That you can see uh, free French uh, rescue play free now. It's I add, but I'm not gonna do that right now. When I do this, it shows the ad, but. I can only see. It's definitely from the App Store. Yeah, but there's more. No, yeah, first lap, X and lap stand, and X two. What's this? Just add screenshots. Does it know when you have to close? Double shoot the back screen, and now and I open up, open back up the battery watch. Click the app again, the ad again, see what happens. Hope does not display black. Okay, nothing does not be wrong with the battery watch app. But I'm um, doing like more re Okay, so if you can be tell me how to get this back to me. Oh, yes. If you could please tell me how to get this battery position on oh, my iPod Touch to rewind it, because my iPod Touch is on version 5.1.1 from where I do not want to break my iPod. Please tell me, please, be, please rate, comment, rate. Please rate, comment, but do not subscribe. And please don't say stupid comments that that does not work. That 
Oh, this video doesn't have the light. Give me my nail pad. I need a 